even though it's another game that's inevitably finished off in each, how would you ensure summarise that performance? Yeah, we were a bit disappointed, it was a game we wanted to win, uh, it was a game we were desperate to win if I'm being honest, but um, I think we, we feel a wee bit disappointed, we, certainly the way we, we played in the first half, we felt we were going to leave it. Um, we were a wee bit reactive rather than proactive and, and, and it didn't, we didn't dominate the ball again, how we want to dominate the ball. Having said that, the longer the game went, um, as, as, as happens in games like this, the game gets stretched and, and once we managed to get control of, control of the ball, I thought we, looked, I thought we finished the, the game strong and, and we looked like we were, we, were, we were close to getting a goal at the, at the end there. And I suppose one of the main positives we can take is it's the second clean sheet in two weeks. Yeah, uh, and a lot of that goes down to Scott Fox's performance today. Um, when we needed a goalkeeper today, um, Scott certainly stood up to the plate. Uh, it's no surprise for, for, for me and Stuart, we feel we have the best goalkeeper in the league and, and Scott performs like that uh, every day, to be honest. And, uh, and he, he got his rewards today with his clean sheet. And we did finish strongly, we saw the subs contributing as well when they came on. Yeah, uh, they did. Uh, they contributed uh, in a positive manner, which is, which is all we can ask. We have 20 players uh, desperate to play on our team. Uh, unfortunately we can only play 11 uh, and we can only make three changes so um, the players that, that contributed today were, uh, were the guys that started obviously done their part and, and, and without a doubt the guys that came off gave us that little injection of positivity that we needed and, and, and at the stage of the game where we thought we could nick a goal um, we thought they were the guys that were, were maybe going to provide that Stephen, thanks for your time Thank you